Now let's go and fix our edit button so the user can be able to delete a student. So let's go to our index dot blade. Let's quickly close them and warp this with a form. So in here we I will type form and let's add it here. Then in the form we will type the action so for now it's empty so let's keep it empty then after action may our method so post and after that let's add an style as well for this so let's say a style display in line in line now let's type on submit in here we will just display a pop-up to user to confirm the delete so we will say return confirm and we will write our message so are you sure you want to delete this student let's fix our delete and after this we have to add our CSRF so let's type CSRF because the method that we are going in the route the method that uh, route type that we are going to use is delete in that case we also have to type add method then delete let's uh, actually we don't need it now we just have to create a submit button so we will type button type is equal to submit and let's give him a class of btn btn danger and btn small button is now d8 so let's go here refresh okay nothing changed good now let's go and create our route so in here let's create a new route so let's type route colon colon delete student slash or let's just call it delete slash the id and we will make a new method inside our controller with the name of destroy so let's fix destroy let's go here and in here let's type public function destroy and we accept request dollar sign request and we also accept the id of the student then in inside this we will again say dollar sign student is equal to a student model colon confine or fail dollar sign id and finally delete and we will redirect back to our index method now let's add this route to our delete form so in here let's type a student slash delete and in the second parameter the student id so is student id now let's go refresh okay let's delete this student click the delete we got our message click ok okay it's redirected now let's check now it has been deleted so let's delete the test as well click delete ok let's come back yeah our test has been also deleted